would like to tell you a secret, so come here. This? It no, no, no. Please let me say it. I want to tell. Okay, darling, go ahead. Tell. This is... This is not just this sing-along like all them other sing-alongs. Pretty much the same. Everybody knew my name. They followed me from the studio. Maybe my own television show. That's joy. That's just joy. And that's what she wanted. Excellent. I'm ready. I'm always born ready, as they say. Ooh, uh, I think my title would be Lamb Chop's sister. <laughs> Lamb Chop is my little sister. She's a national icon. She's 18 inches tall, perpetually six years old. Um, she's, you know, Lamb Chop. And for 60 odd years, the family has been in service of Lamb Chop. My mom was Sherry Lewis. She had a TV show in New York and the Captain Kangaroo show called and said, we love you, but we hate your puppets. Do you have anything else? Grandfather said, if Mary can have a little lamb, why can't Sherry? And my mother went, daddy, and threw Lamb Chop under the bed. I don't know if that's apocryphal or not, um, but she pulled Lamb Chop out, and Lamb Chop was born on the Captain Kangaroo show. She came and brought that energy to everything. <laughs> and the strings. Mom was diagnosed with terminal cancer at 11 a.m. On, on the, I guess, 17th. And um, she came into rehearsal by one o'clock. We had, so we had to finish shooting these three episodes. And on the last day, she was laying on the ground with, I think, Lamb Chop and Charlie Horse. And we were cropping it. and. She couldn't keep the voices separate. And finally I said, that's okay, mom, we got it. I was, you know, and she goes, are you gonna be able to fix that in post? And I said, oh yeah, no problem, and I was. But that was the only time I ever saw her have a problem. I got the call from the hospital. Uh, my father had pulled the plug without telling me. Um, and when I questioned that, he said, well, you know, I didn't want to upset you because you're pregnant. And I'm like, okay, but we knew she was going to die. So, and he stayed home and watched a football game as opposed to staying with my mom while she passed because he said it could have taken hours. When mom died, I got a lot of letters from people saying, you know, we're so sorry that your mom has passed. Um, is Lamb Chop dead too? And I couldn't let that answer be yes. Yeah, I couldn't let Lamb Chop be dead. I'm rolling. Okay, you're rolling. <laughs> okay. Um, yes. We'll start by saying it. Yes. Uh... Okay, my name is Lamb Chop. L A M B C H O T, capital L and capital C. Good girl. That's a lot for a six-year-old. Well, Sherry knew stuff. And you're saying I don't know stuff? Not as much stuff. <laughs> Thanks for that. Sherry was my mom. This is just my sister. Just? I think Lamb Chop uh, represents to people a time when they were um, safe, when they were little, before pandemics, <laughs> before taxes, before, you know, all the responsibilities that come with being an adult. The relationship that children had with my mother was perfect, and Lamb Chop was a part of that. Hello? Hey, it's Mallory. Is this a good time? Yeah, I can talk. How can Lamb Chop be of service to you two? <laughs> I think you should just turn to her right now and ask her to right be your now. wife right now while Lamb Chop's here. 
Come on, I think I think you should just say, will you marry me? You are the most beautiful, wonderful, smartest, prettiest, nicest woman in the world, and you are the mother of my children. So that's what I would do. That's what Lamb Chop thinks he should do. Babe, we've been together since last year. It's been about a year, but we're going on two years now. You married me. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh my yeah. God, you're making me. Oops, sorry, go ahead. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Hello, Cody. Thank you so much. I love my lights. <laughs> you don't need lighting, you're beautiful. I know it's because I'm only six. Yes. All right, Lamb Chop, I'm very sorry, darling. Would you take your hands off that microphone? Sorry, I'm sorry. Well, you're cranky today. I didn't like the way you introduced me. All right, I'll introduce you. I'll introduce you. Now you got me doing it. <laughs> I'll introduce... I'll introduce you properly, ladies and gentlemen. I love this. Presenting my favorite supporting act, Miss... What are you shaking? I am not your support. Wedding act. <laughs> oh, she kills me. I want people to know that even if you're tiny and only six years old, you can do good stuff. And I wanna, I wanna live forever. I wanna always be me. You do you, Lamb Chop. You do you, Mallory. And what is so funny? What is so funny is that I don't support you. You support me. These people did not come here to see you. They came to see me, right? Right? Tell her, tell her. <laughs> How does Lamb Chop's story end? Well, she's the song that doesn't end. So, hopefully that. I am the lamb that doesn't end. Yes, I'll go on and on my trend. Some people started loving me, not knowing what I was. And they'll continue loving me forever just because enough. If I ask you a question, would you give me an honest answer? When did I ever lie to you? What about the time I asked you how old you were? What did I say? 21. Well, that was a little while ago. You're damn right it was. Lamb chop. Hey everyone, Cody Broadway here. Thank you so much for taking the time to check out the NBCLX YouTube channel. Be sure to click here for more videos and also click here to subscribe to join the NBCLX community.